Welcome to First Word Farmers News Roundup for January the 15th, brought to you today by Senior Editor Matt Dennis. In our top news story, France's health ministry said that six participants in an early stage study of an experimental oral drug have been hospitalised after a serious accident. The ministry noted that one of the people is on life support, while other volunteers who took the treatment are being recalled. The drug is being developed by a European drug maker, with reports suggesting that the medicine was a cannabis-based painkiller from Bial. The study was conducted by clinical research organisation Biotrial. In other news, Merck & Co reached an agreement under which it will pay $830 million to settle a class action lawsuit related to Viox. The settlement relates to investors who bought Merck Securities and who were seeking damages for certain statements made regarding Viox. In addition, a report from the US Government Accountability Office raised concerns over the FDA's ability to track safety issues once drugs are approved. Specifically, the Government Accountability Office stated the FDA lacks reliable, readily accessible data on tracked safety issues and post-market studies. And finally, Italy secured around €200 million Euros in refunded payments from drug makers last year for ineffective cancer medicines. The repayments came after the Italian Medicines Agency reached deals with companies that link payments to how well a patient responds to treatment. To read these and other stories in full, visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today.